Fear versus courage. It's a choice. Who or what builds those self-imposed barriers? Well, it's a stonemason called fear. <laughs> no, I didn't make this up. We found a, a motivational speaker, Danny Cox, said that fear doesn't really exist. It's built in our minds and we build it and we put it there. And fear is something that can absolutely demolish adventure. And it's fear that can keep us standing still. Now on a positive note, <laughs> it's courage that can just absolutely break the barriers of fear. And what we focus on, that's what becomes our reality. We can choose to keep fear in the background and keep it back there and keep moving forward, or we can choose to focus on what frightens us and stay standing still. But we all have a choice every day. And I remember uh, in many books and uh, through many off, off authors, the, they talk about the fact that so many of the things that we're afraid of never come to fruition. <laughs> so they truly are just a state of mind. Peter Drucker says, crisis should never be experienced for a second time. <laughs> Danny Cox says, adversity puts iron in our flesh. Um, as astronaut Steve Smith uh, turned adversity into opportunity. He was passionate about space from a very young age and he was adamant that he wanted to be an astronaut and he applied the took it test. He took the test four <laughs> times. Took it test. Took it test as oh, you took, took it, it took it, took it. <laughs> he took the test four times and was unsuccessful and he took the test the fifth time and was successful. So that was his commitment and his willingness to face adversity and, and uh, reach success. Yeah, so since then, he's been able to be in space. I think he's had seven space flights into space. He has been outside the shuttle in space for 49 and a half hours. I mean, it's incredible what he has, uh, what he's completed. I and mean, you'll see a link to a, a YouTube video that he talks about the moon is just the beginning. We are, the next step is Mars. And to, space tourism is going to be as common down, I don't know how many years from now, but as common as flying in a plane. So it's quite incredible the things that are going to unravel um, in, still in, in our lifetime. So if Steve Smith had been stopped uh, by um, the fear of failure or the, the fear of trying one more time and the, the fear of not making it, then we would not, you know, he would not be the greatest or such a great contributor to our history as he is now. I mean, one person has the ability to make an impact. And in this online world, one person has the ability to have, make an impact. I mean, differently than he did, but still in the online world, one person can impact thousands of people in a positive way. And the story is the same. It takes courage to, to take on a new skill. It takes courage to to try something new you have to be resilient because there's a good chance you won't be successful the first time and as we've talked in previous videos it's grit you've got to dust yourself off pick yourself up and go again when you decide to start your online journey we warn you it will be a leap of faith <laughs> for sure <laughs> when we started we had no idea what was on the other side and it has been an incredible journey and we haven't been on our own there have been people with us along the way and and we'll be here to help but it still will be a leap of faith when we were putting together the blog today we found a, a quote that anonymous author author unknown author unknown that said fear knocked on the door and faith answered and nobody was there nobody there <laughs> <laughs> so having faith can defeat fear and it is that leap of faith but we did it and you can too
Because remember, fear is just in our minds. It's what we imagine our barriers to be, but it doesn't really exist. So have the courage, break through the fear, and who knows what will happen and where it will lead. You know, and, and what we're talking about is understanding what traditional has traditional work has been and what the new world of online business is all about. It's an opportunity to get out of the office. It's an opportunity to, to get away from the gridlock and rush hour, get away from office politics and control your own life and set your own journey and have the freedom to live the life your way. Yes, as Steve Smith was here, he would say, dreams really do come true. Please reach out to us when you feel courageous. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're good to talk to, and we'd love to hear from you. Bye for now. Bye for now.